Okay, welcome back. All right, I want to show you that um, basically we're going to be retopologizing the mesh, so making the whole thing a lot smoother and a lot more organized. But there is something I've done here that I want to show you, and that is basically I've spread the fingers. So I've used the old masking technique that we used earlier. I've gone to a side view, and then I've picked uh, rotate, and then I've clicked and held the shift key oh not quite like that so I've shift I've held the control key as I've clicked something's going wrong here need to go back into draw mode um, I think I've got some masking on somewhere, possibly a leftover bit of masking. So let's just check everything's kind of working okay. Sometimes you'll have these little problems. Uh, we're going to go into rotate again and I'm simply going to hold the shift key as I drag, which is causing some really weird things to happen. sometimes you might get some things happen and um, it might be best to exit and come back in that way it will refresh everything we've got going on so that's what I'm gonna do rather than get to the bottom of why it was doing that it's just easier to come out and come back in and just redraw our character back up straight into edit mode straight into file shader turn it on the side and you'll see that I spread the, the fingers already so as I said before go into rotate mode and control click so press the control key and drag out from the hand until you isolate your finger like so and then you can move these by clicking the outer circle into position check that it's ok this way as well like this and then you can just rotate those fingers out you might also want to use the move tool up here and just shift this so that it is in the position of course you've got symmetry turn on it will do exactly the same on the other side so once you've got your hands in that position so they're nicely spread out what we're looking for is nice big gaps between the the fingers so that we can go in there and get clean lines so I'm now going to be going to this and I'm going to be selecting the smooth tool I'm going to bring this down going to smooth tool I'm going to turn this down to about 17 something like that so you might turn it up a little bit more and we're basically just trying to clean those fingers up around these areas I'm going to turn it right up and I might even bring the geometry down a little bit maybe to level 4 that'll clean up around there clean up around here as well so I'm just trying to clean these fingers up so that it's going to be easy for us to draw the topology in I can always put this detail that we put in earlier I can always put that back in so I'm not worried about that at this moment it's mainly about these hands which are pretty crucial so you want to make sure there's a nice clean big gap between those fingers for you to come in with your retopology tools so once you've done it and you're happy with it and you've also checked that the other thing the other hand has been done as well which he has then we're ready to go into the topological masking tool, the uh, topological masking, the retopology tool to actually 
remesh our character and join me in the next lesson where we'll go straight on to retopologizing our model uh, optimizing the mesh for animation and games